Okay, and these guys are Popeye Grenadiers with large eyes and a narrow looking body. And so they're very rare because like no one ever really sees them because they are so far deep. So we don't really know much about them. But they do blow like a lot of animals down here do. And every animal down here has to be, um, has to be adapted to the incredible depth and pressure, temperature, and very, very little light. So they never, no animal down here has good eyesight. All right, and these are some of my favorite animals ever. These are sea pigs, which live on the bottom of the ocean, on the floor, and they just kind of swim casually along and then look like they, they're walking. And they're pretty cool. They just kind of chill out down here. So, and then over here we have, these are glass squid, which are um, pretty much uh, transparent and they kind of glow. They're phosphorescent. So, these are glass squid. All right, and now we're gonna try and find, okay, an oar fish is pretty cool. It's this huge, huge fish. Oh, here's a giant squid, conveniently. <laughs> and so giant squid live to be pretty much about 60 feet. They're always over 30 feet long, or their tentacles are 30 feet long. And its eyes are about 20 inches in diameter. And it has the biggest eyes of any living creature. So, that's the giant squid. And then here we have Briso's dolphins, which are some of the only dolphins to live this deep. And they just swim and they live in groups up to um, a couple dozen. And they look white because they have a ton of scars on their skin. Um, so, because this is a pretty harsh environment down here. Alright, so we're looking for... Fan fins are pretty cool. Alright. Some more Popeye Grenadiers. Alright, and this is a fan fin. They're pretty weird looking animals. With huge, like, thready fins. So... They're pretty cool. There's another one. Some other fish. Alright, now we're going to look for and see if we can find... Alright, the oar fish is back here, I guess. And the oar fish is this huge, huge, huge fish that's really, really pretty. This is it up here. So that's the oarfish, and it can be 33 feet long, and the fins are red, with like a really pretty red, and you, we really don't know much about it because it lives so deep again, but there are pictures of people who have caught oarfish, and it takes several men to hold it, so. And then we have some other species include vampire squid, um, pelican eels, 
Uh, we also have some crabs that live down here. And then there's the humpback anglerfish, which is the fish that, um, that is in Finding Nemo that attacks them. And then there's, of course, and then we have giant sea spiders and a couple other animals that live down here. But again, you'll notice that we haven't really seen any plant life because there is no light down here for photosynthesis. So the only, so bacteria reproduce or live by um, the vents, the thermal vents down here, but that's about it. And that concludes our tour of the abyss, the abyssal zone.